I'm Laura Roberts. And I'm Claudia Roberts. And we're both PhD students here at Princeton University in computer science. I graduated from MIT with a degree in electrical engineering and computer science. And it was while I was working that I got uh, interested in cybersecurity. And I wanted to develop more expertise in security. It seemed like a PhD program would be a, an excellent way to do that. I went to Stanford and I got my bachelor's in computer science. And then after that, I worked for four years as well in, in industry at Apple. I still remember when I got the phone call from my sister and she was like, oh, I'm, going to, uh, I'm going to Princeton for my PhD. And uh, I was so proud. That was all I needed to then apply the following year. Hi. Hello, Hi. Hi. Hi, Daddy. Well, our parents were very influential on us, and my mom studied computer science, and my dad studied biology, and he was always into technology and the latest gadgets. Our mom would help us, you know, with our math homework or teach us extra things that maybe that the teachers didn't. You know, we're raising two girls in America. How do we set them up for success that can put us in a position where we can thrive in this society? I'm interested in recommendation systems. Many people think that when they're searching for something or they're being recommended something through, whether it's movies or songs, that they're getting what's most relevant to them. But that is not the case. Companies are incentivized to make these recommendation systems better and better and better. And that's exactly where the Center for Information Technology Policy, which we're both a part of, that's where our research comes in. What are the unintended consequences of these systems once they go out in society? We want to identify what groups are being harmed and also what context. And we also want to mitigate um, the effects that we're seeing on society. So my work is more on the security side of things, but our goal is the same, right? To help people be safer on the internet. We are both part of the Wesley L. Harris Scientific Society and is a group that brings um, together underrepresented students in science and technology. Undergrad students come and we are able to mentor them and help them. Where I was for undergrad, I didn't interact with graduate students. So the yeah. fact that these undergrads are already getting exposed to us exactly. and to the research that we're doing, that's really In impressive. In a comfortable setting. My advisor has helped me truly understand what research is about. And that is, what is our responsibility as people creating this technology and making sure that it, there aren't negative consequences down, that we are not foreseeing. Computer science is about more than just the technical aspects, mm -hmm. and we need to be aware of how what we do is going to impact society and the people around us.